Hi Vogue Australia, I'm Margot Robbie and this is my Rewind. The Wolf of Wall Street. Wake up you piece of shit! Ow! Who's Venice? Huh? Who? 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 What are you, a fucking owl? Who is she? Wait, I don't know some little hooky you were fucking last what night. What the fuck are you talking about? No, no way, baby, no! I remember, do you know what, that line, uh, who? Who? What are you, a fucking owl? That wasn't in the script either, and Leo's friend was visiting set that day, and he came up to me and he's like, he's like, oh, you know when he says, like, who's Venice, who? He's like, do you know what a funny line is? Say, who, who, what are you fucking out? And I was like, oh yeah, great idea. And then I did, and now it's in the movie. <laughs> Birds of Prey. I'll give you till midnight. You pickle it. Okay? Um, I'm laughing because I just remembered. I haven't watched Birds of Prey probably since it came out. Just watching that now, I remember there was the funniest outtake, Ewan, who plays Black Mask. When he comes up close to my face and he says a line that's meant to be menacing, I can't remember, but he said something wrong on the day and we burst out laughing and something that you don't get to see. I don't know why it's died out. Blooper reels is something that you always kind of make when you're making a movie and you play it to the crew. We play it at the after party, the rap party or whatever. But anyways, our blooper reel for Birds of Prey was so hilarious and that take just reminded me. The Barbie trailer. Hey Barbie, can I come to your house tonight? Sure. I don't have anything big planned, just a giant blowout party with all the Barbies and plant choreography and a bespoke song. You should stop by. So cool. So obviously that's the Barbie trailer. It's it's just, it's so good. And I'm so excited for people to experience it. It was just like a dance party every day. Like every day on set was so fun and ridiculous. And the movie's so silly. It's so smart and it's so silly at the same time. Every day it's like, ooh, we got the dance party today. Like, oh, we're going rollerblading today. Or... I, Tonya. I can't ever, I mean, I'd rather do the jail time, please. The, they, they only got 18 months. They, they got 18 months. I, I'll do that. You can't. Your Honor, I don't have an education. We did the whole movie, I think, in 31 days. Um, I was a producer on this film too. It was chaos, but it was so fun. It was so hard though. It was really, really hard. Um, you know, it was an indie film. We didn't have a lot of money. We had 200 and something scenes and two Olympics and it was a period piece. And it, yeah, it was just hard. It was, that was a tough shoot. Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. One, please. 75 cents. What if I'm in the movie? What do you mean? I mean, I'm in the movie. I'm Sharon Tate. Mr. Helm? Yes. Oh! <laughs> oh. oh I'm Freya. Welcome to Denmark, Mr. Helm. When Once Upon a Time in Hollywood came out, I went on a Tuesday afternoon, because when we were shooting this scene, Quentin said to me, he's like, you should do this. You should go to the movies and you should see Once Upon a Time in Hollywood when it comes out. Just go on your own, go on like a Tuesday afternoon or something. I pretty much ended up recreating, like redoing the scene. I, I went up to the ticket counter and I was like, can I get a ticket to Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? And they were like, the person at the ticket counter was like, yeah, but you're, you're in the movie. And I'm like, no, I know. And they're like, you're in. And I'm like, no, I know. And they're like, and that scene shoots here. And I was like, I know, that's why I'm here. I'm gonna, I wanted to see it, you know, where we shot the scene. And he was like, could I, oh, I don't wanna ask, but could I get a photo? And I was like, we're literally doing the scene from the movie. <laughs> it's, um, it would be only perfect for you to ask that. And a man that was in the theater watching the movie too, kind of like looked over and like, kind of clocked that I had just walked out of the theater too and was kind of like, huh. And I was like, hmm. And he was like, and we just kind of like nodded at each other and walked away. It was a very cool moment. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the theaters. <laughs>